five. Uh, DJ isn't going to get into the defense. Even when he's getting hit, he overpowers them and finds a way to finish. Now, Miracic. Outside, Levine. Fires from the line. Goes back up. And it's good on the way up. And, and you just hate to give up those second chance points. Uh, it could be discouraging, frustrating, but you only have yourselves to blame. Box out. And the shot goes in. Uh, it's never really easy trying to contain DJ. You, you see how he goes right at the deep, bouncing off the contact and maintaining his body control. Double by Bogdanovich. Here's Gooding. And a strong finish with two hands. Gooding! An aggressive move and fantastic finish. Mm -hmm. Trying to send a message with that slam, I think. White with it. Now defended by Levine. Levine against White. And, uh, oh, here, there's a whistle. He is going up for a layup. And while it looked like there was some contact, I wasn't sure they were going to call it a foul shot or not. But sure enough, they have. So he'll head to the free throw line. Cameron Payne's checked in for Levine. And he's been to the line much more here than he was in that first half. He's not playing nearly as tentatively as he was earlier. And Gasol comes to help. Miritich with it. He feeds it to Baines. That one, no good. Some solid defense from Gasol. White down low, working on Payne. Low block shot. And DJ with the nice bucket inside. DJ's got eight points in the quarter. Bulls trail by seven. Doubled by White. So it's the Grizzlies now. And the Grizzlies leading by seven. to Wells from downtown. Offensive rebound. DJ on the follow. Not a lot of resistance on the inside, and they're taking full advantage. Here's the screen. Here's Payne. And the Bulls with another miss. Man, right play, wrong result on that one. Generally, you knock those down. Well, I like the decision they can though. I mean, that's a shot you want to keep taking. And the shot goes in. And now it's an 11-point Grizzly lead. And he can smell blood in the water. Excellent finish. Oh, you're up by double digits. They're trying to keep the momentum, keep the foot on the neck. That's his focus right now. Cranes the three-pointer. Oh, he's feeling it this half. Total turnaround after a rough first half. Memphis is going outside a lot tonight. 17 times, in fact. 7 of 17. That one goes. Count it. They are just killing them on the interior. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. Yeah, and the amount of points they've given up here in the paint, that, that's what they got to talk about. Ooh, this is ugly. No question about it. And you wonder if these matchups aren't favoring them right now. And the Bulls making a change here. Monroe's checked in. And the Grizzlies also with the sub. Magruder's checked in. All right, let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Hey guys, I was able to listen in to what Fred Hoiberg told his team. He does not like the high foul number in this game. He told them, you've got to stop biting on the shot fake. Stop gambling for steals. That's giving them easy points at the line. We'll see how they respond. Oh, nice determination by Johnson. Looking to score, and he draws some contact. And he makes both free throws. Chris, if you were on the rules committee, what rule change would you like to see the NBA make going forward? Kevin, there's not a rule I'd necessarily have changed, but I'd ask them to kind of reinterpret a couple of rules, and that goes with the flagrant foul. I often see so many plays that are just hard fouls called as flagrant fouls, and that can affect not only a player and later on, whether it's a flagrant two, but it can affect the game. It can affect the next game by how it's interpreted by a player being kicked out because of that. And, so I, I just want to take the sensitivity or, or put the toughness back into that. So many flagrant fouls are called and they're not going at the head or they're, they're chopping down on the wrist. And, and I just like
like to, to see it get back to be interpreted as it was uh, a little while ago, maybe 20, 25 years ago. Chandler Parsons, he's checked in for Rodney Magruder. He hits the second from the line. Bulls trail by nine. Here's Payne, and Gasol comes to help. Here's Gooding, and again, it's the Bulls from deep. Wow, that's his fourth three of the game. Two in each half. He has just owned that line. Right side, White. A second chance effort. He lays it in. I'm getting too many and the points. Right lead by I'm, getting, I'm getting a whole lot of points. They're battling hard on the glass. They hold the advantage. I don't know. Maybe so I might far. get 30,000 points. And Mirojic has right. it in the corner. Nailed from three-point land. But I definitely can tell you that got Pro Man is not even a lot of points. After a sensational first half from beyond the arc, he's not slowing down here in the second. That's his third point Somebody has to be cut out in the whole time. I played four and nine games. That free throw, no good. I'm out here, Mr. And he sinks the Somebody second. Somebody out here cut out. Like in regards to getting. Now Chicago has gone 4-6 from beyond the arc in the fourth, in the fourth quarter so far. Payne dishes to Maritich. My job was like grab boys. I got my son. Here's Gooding. That's pretty much the thing. And the Bulls, another three. Defensively, they just look out of sync. Closing out on the threes in time. Here's DJ. Stolen by Monroe. That's cheap. Hey, I'm definitely against Gasol. Gasol with the steal. Outside, White. What? And the shot no good. A bit short. Yeah, that's just poor decision making. He's got to be better in those situations. Uh, I'd love to hear his explanation of coach out. right there. I mean, that should be an interesting conversation. Now, I can't here is Miritich. It's Chicago with that another bucket. It, it, it just seems point. that every pass what? they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. This might be a tie. And White kicks to Parsons. Knocks down the three ball. Basically, got to play all position also. thanks to the accuracy from beyond. Hopefully, I get a lot of shit. There's a screen. This, I don't know. Payne kicks to Mirror. And I'm playing a whole thing. Trying to answer back, back, but that three is off the mark. Memphis leading by four. White with it. Now guarded by Payne. I think we should have a bonus. He throw good, DJ. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. I may be able to hit 90. Oh, here's Payne. I would say probably 90 points. I would probably go for 100, but I got to see it. Gotta... To the wing right side. Johnson's come for the double team and taken away by Johnson. Here's White. <laughs> So he gets the whistle, contact the way up, and two shots coming up. Oh, the officials are all over that one. And that one falls for White. So he gets them both. And so here is Chicago. Payne passes to Markinen. And that's out of bounds. Chicago will retain possession. That's not a problem, too. I'm playing all sorts of types of ball, like that. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Gooding, covered by Parsons. Dishes it to Payne. Four on the clock. And the three ball is good. Payne's got a couple of three-pointers now in the fourth for Chicago. And defensively, you have got to extend to their shooters. They have been on fire this half. Yeah, they've been tremendous from beyond the arc. It's a shift from what they did in the first two. What? Oh, oh no. He's the last guy you want to put on the line. You can just about book the points every time he steps up there. I can get this trail by six. And the foul called on DJ. That's his fourth foul of the contest. I think that's what I have, but this is like the last. He's in the last. 
to the paint and stolen by Parsons. Yeah, and that's turned over in about the most. Yeah, this is points way. right here. So I'm gonna get my one thing if the defender makes a great play, okay, but to lose control of it and get called for the over and back, that, that's tough to swap. Portis is checked in for the Bulls. One fifty-one left in the fourth quarter. Wells comes with the double team. Now here's Payne, white covering. I want to see how many points I get off this. Basically, you see what I do the whole game. I don't really necessarily, like, I'm not the type of person that just chug up threes a lot. And it's the Bulls with the ball. Miritich dishes the paint. Pass to Portis. Just five to shoot. Marking in good. This game is slow, so I mean, I know I'm going to get putting up a ton of shots from deep. Stacks and stacks and stacks. They're what? looking to stack up some points. They've gotten into a nice groove from out there. Payne with it. All guarded by DJ. And that's not a problem. That's not a problem. Wide open look. And it's Gasol with the rebound. Gasol's got his sixth rebound on the night. Outside, White. They retain possession, and the whistle stops game play. It's not a clean block shot. Instead of shooting foul, and both the free throws come up right here. That's, that's my problem. The free throw off from Gasol. And there are too many big men more dependable than Gasol. He's a skilled passer who can operate out of that high post. Oh, oh, give you oh, If you need it. And there's the bucket for Markinen. Defenders need to recognize the importance of staying on him as we get what? into crunch time. Here's DJ. That's in there. Johnson with the assist. And the Grizzlies. I don't want to get fouled, six. but we want to see how many. You know what? I like Johnson's unselfishness. Ready and willing to move it to the open man. Chicago calls timeout. They're trailing by six. 40 seconds left to play here. I on the got board. 94 and points. Now let's present our Jordan rebounds, player of the game, DJ. Like and guys, no doubt who our pick was going to be. I could have been a 90. Made everyone else on this board look like they're playing at half speed. I've it's been, been busy with total domination. And you can't help but just sit back and admire that performance. Here's Payne. Offensive rebound, good. And the bucket counts, three points. Yeah, this game's gonna be close. I know he I'm gonna get fouled. I have to get my 100 points. He does what he should. Goes right back up with you. Basket here, and this game may be all over. Yeah, but but the main priority, Kevin, has to be taking care of the basketball. <laughs> I hit that and using the clock. Yeah, it's gotta like Yeah, come it is. It is a good in big spots. Absolutely fearless. Such a clutch play. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. They're trailing by five. Twenty-nine seconds left in the fourth quarter. Twenty-nine seconds left in the fourth. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. DJ plays with a lot of confidence. When he slashes to the rim, he's looking to get all the way to the cup. And really, nothing they can do now. They just got to play this I'm going to follow him right there yeah, you know just because I can. And just an attempt, an attempt so frustrated right now. I don't see my... Good on the first. And just that turns the lead to six. And the second free throw, no good. A tough break there. Oh and now God. we've got the intentional foul. I'm not going to get it. That's insane. And no good as the first free throw missing for him. We'll see if he can nail the second. And the foul called on DJ. And that's it for him. He's fouled out. And so the Grizzlies take the win. At least I got my points. Limitless range, but you got to play within your badges, so I'm not sure necessarily what's going to happen here, so. Wow, I don't got 21 for all that? That don't make any sense. Thanks very much. Now you let the charge with not that make fourth any quarter. Sense. How did you take control but of this game and get your team to win? What I'm getting. 